That's Venon, isn't it? Welcome back, everyone. Savage Sasquatch here, and we're back with more God of War. And we have saved the boy in our last video. We went to Helheim and back, and now we're going to press forward and see what we can find. All right, so we're going to see what's behind this door here. Lies beyond this door. This is, a, this is a hidden chamber that we've opened. This is number one of seven. We've seen several of these. So what? What lies back here? Oh, we can. We can push this up. So far, nothing. What's this up with this little window here? This is all very mysterious looking. It's a place. It feels like... like a prison. That would explain the hefty magical lock on the outside. But it's more than that. I have this feeling. Like something is waiting for us down here. You've a knack for ominous statements, lad. What kind of something? I'm not sure. Something powerful. Whatever you feel, boy, we will handle it. We have come this far, yes? Yes, father. I think we're good on health. There's a portal. More health. Oh. I will take the treasure. Sharp Relic of Shadows. That's not everyday loot, it doesn't seem. Health everywhere. Which is... A Valkyrie imprisoned. She actually did it. A Valkyrie? But I thought they were just spirits. Take caution, lads. A Valkyrie in the flesh. I can't think of a more formidable opponent. She does not attack. Does she even know we're here? All right. So we get the quest to defeat a Valkyrie. Before we do that, I want to just explore out here find the loot that's hiding underneath, apparently. That's like 3,000 hack silver, plus whatever's in here, another 3,000. Easy peasy. Six grand. And in we go. Okay, so here's a Valkyrie. I have died a number of times to this boss. Start out with our super to make sure it hits. And we're gonna spin to win. You wanna make sure you're using Atreus's. All right, block the rain shots. Lock all those. And let's get our punchy time in so we get some health back. 
not a lot, but it helps and it's a nice little trade-off on, on damage. And there we go. Big hit, come on. Come on, get her. Come on, big hits. You don't want to be Did that get her? No. Alright, I'm gonna block here a lot. There we go. Yes! The Valkyrie is mine. No more wings for you. Woo! Man! That... You freed me from my corrupted form. You have my eternal gratitude. But my sisters remain trapped as I was. Take my helm. Find them. Free them. The fate of the Valkyries rests on your shoulders. Happy to. And time for the loot. The fate of the Valkyries. Sounds pretty important. That's putting it mildly, lad. What do you know of them? A fair question, and yet not one easily answered. I know more than most, but much of their history is veiled in secrecy. My own experience with the Valkyries ends with my imprisonment. You are avoiding the question, Head. As I said, brother, it's complicated. I don't know why or how they become such wretched creatures. But perhaps if we can free more of them. You want us to find more of those things? The fate of the Valkyries, lad. A more worthy endeavor there is not. It will be dangerous. Well, that hasn't stopped you before, eh? <sighs> That's the spirit. You have started a legendary favor. Corrupted Valkyries are powerful creatures found in the depths of hidden chambers of Odin and other realms. Defeating them is no easy task and requires powerful equipment. Find and defeat all corrupted Valkyries to uncover the truth and receive legendary rewards. We got the Helm of Kara. What is that? That is... Used to upgrade armor, pommels, and talismans with the power of Valkyries. Okay. Increases the damage inflicted to all barehanded attacks by 6%. And we don't use barehanded very much, so that's not that good for us. There it is. What is this? Talisman of the Realm. Summon a realm shift that temporarily slows down surrounding enemies. Upgrade to increase the duration. So what do we have now? Right now we have this amulet that gives the last second dodge. It looks like this one is actually on command. It gives us, really, I think, a little better 
see. Yeah, a little bit around the stats, too. Okay. So we can grab this here. And then we can move it to here. Okay, so we take the flames from there. We move out to here. We have enough time as long as we get it right. And that goes through. Easy enough. Now we can take that fire from here. And we should be able to very quickly and easily transfer it right up to here. And then from here. We can transfer it to the door. I'm excited to find out what lies behind here. Yes. Light runic attack. All right, so we're gonna take the lift down here, head back towards our quest for the moment. Although, honestly, before we get much farther, I really do want to explore out and find all those Valkyries that we can, knock down whatever baddies we can, maybe even go to Muspelheim, because I want to challenge. Having a great time with this, but the more challenges we find, the more fun we'll have. Can't get off there. One more floor. Ah, see? The boat washed ashore. Someone did call a serpent earlier. Get in. I will pull. You are quiet. Are you not better? I guess. I know you overheard my talk with Freya. You think you understand, but you do not. Why do you say nothing? You said I was cursed. You think I'm weak because I'm not like you. I know I was never what you wanted. But after all this, I thought... Maybe things were different. You do not know everything, boy. No. But at least I know the truth now. The truth? The truth? I am a god, boy. From another land far from here. When I came to these shores, I chose to live as a man. But the truth is, I was born a god, and so were you. Boy, have you nothing to say? Um, can I turn into an animal? <laughs> can you turn into an animal? No, I do not think so. I'm a god. Mother knew? She was a god too? No. She was mortal, but she knew my true nature. I'm a god. Why did you wait so long to tell me? Time of anguish and tragedy. That is the curse. Hmm. What sorts of things can I do? Can I fly? 
turn invisible? I don't feel like God. I do not know the reach of your godhood. But over time, you will learn. So the truth comes out. You sure I can't turn into a wolf? You are welcome to surprise me. Is this why I hear voices sometimes? Are you sure you've never heard any? Not as you do. That's no surprise. Every god is unique. So, maybe I won't get strong like father, but I'll have abilities all my own? You already do, laddie. Your faculty for language is extraordinary for one so young. Time alone will tell what else you'll become capable of. So you knew all along? I did, lad. But I've known more than my share of gods. Me too, apparently. I wonder who else knew I was a god. Freya, for sure. Brock and Sindri? They do not need to know. Balder! Does he know? Is that why he's after us? Do you know him from before? The day of your mother's funeral was the first I ever saw Balder. That is the truth. Hey, we don't have to go right back to Cares Vault, do we? I mean, we're God. We can do whatever we want, right? What do you really feel like doing now? I will show you. All right, guys, I'm going to explore out the lake here a little bit more before we actually go to Tears Vault. And I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this episode, finding out the fate, or the, uh, the boy finding out his true identity, and also taking on our first Valkyrie. That was awesome. So, hope you guys enjoyed it. If you do, shoot us a thumbs up. We'd love to hear from you guys in the comments. And above all, please subscribe to the channel. We'll keep plenty more action coming your way. So, until next time, this is Savage Sasquatch from GamingReportCard.com, and I am out of here.